Hey there folks, it's Pliskin by 51mm. I am beginning uh, part two of my shotgun choke videos. Talking about the chokes again. This will be part two. It's time that I get around to doing part two. I uploaded part one, I think, like uh, a week or two ago, I do believe. Um, I got busy, as you guys all saw, with the U-Haul uh, video where I showed that I was helping a friend to move and then I had to just kind of take a hiatus there because I was getting a bunch of other stuff I had to do done and um, so now I'm back it's it's good to take a break every now and then uh, so you don't end up overdoing it because when you overdo it you kind of uh, you know get bored with it after a while so anyway uh, this time around uh, of course I'm starting my video the same way like I did part one but this time around they do not have any uh, shotguns to demonstrate for the chokes that I uh, I'm going to be talking about today um, I do have one well I should say we do have one we have a uh, one that is improved cylinder but we do not or modified right I, I misspoke of we do have one that is a modified choke but it is a individual barrel by itself and it's buried in my dad's gun cabinet it's for one of the auto fives and um, it had been more trouble than it's worth to get in there and get all that I did upload the, my first part part one I uploaded it uh, December 10th of this month so it has been quite a bit since I did it but yeah I don't have no uh, shotguns no physical shotguns to show the chokes for like I did part one part one as you all recall if you came from there or if you haven't seen part one yet go check check out part one I will be uh, pasting the link in the comments below pinned comment below and they're going to be in the simple reviews folder so go look there if you're uh, still looking for part one but in part one I covered full choke and cylinder choke uh, shotgun chokes it's empty by the way nothing else just letting y'all know so this time I'm going to be covering improved cylinder and modified cylinder and it's going to be done in the same way as part one where I have uh, b-roll footage of me just talking but it's got graphics and stuff coming over the screen same same format same fashion so let's begin improved cylinder shotgun choke a lot of new gun owners get confused when deciding whether or not to use an improved cylinder choke or a regular cylinder choke and their shotgun bore as you know cylinder choke is known for not giving users any restrictions in their shooting the shot spread is in all directions because the pellets weren't constricted when they left the bore. Now there are some gun owners who like to have a little constriction but not enough to choose a modified choke or full choke. In these situations you would want to go improve cylinder because it gives the user one thousandths of an inch of constriction versus the zero inches of constriction with regular cylinder choke. Best for close to medium range, this choke is also good for CQB. So it gives just a touch more constriction than cylinder, but not enough to make it modified. 